Now this is content. Samworth, <laughs> I found shall kill them. No, first name Ganji, I suppose. We meet again, Prolunter. What is it about the task you gave me? Yeah, have you made any progress on it? <laughs> I can't quite do the voice. I find I found Shulk the Quick hiding at Buffalo and gave him his punishment. <laughs> and we'll be a lot better off without him. Thank you, Mr. Prolunter. Oh, he doesn't like me anymore. Maybe if I, if I reject the money, will he like me more? This is blood money. I can't accept it. Yeah, he likes me a bit more. He's still, still negative. I think it has to be neutral. Maybe, Sam, you'd like me more if we bonded over a trip t to the land of Saran. <laughs> it's very far from here. And I, but I do already know the way, so it'll just be us two. It'll be very romantic. Oh, that reminds me, my bloody girlfriend's waiting for me. Sorry, Sam, I've got a girlfriend. Bye. <laughs> all right, all right, Mr. Prol on her. <laughs> you have a good time with your girlfriend there. I'll, I'll just be back here. Mm. <laughs> this Lambus bread it, it, it absorbs the tears nicely, Mr. Frodo. <laughs> Without delay, I jumped on the nearest ship. Killing its occupants and sailing east across the Great River, as the Texans referred to it. Oh, what's this? <laughs> Another date. Ah, oh, but I'm double booked. Sorry, I can't come on military campaign. I understand you are paying me, and I never do any work for you. You see, I was on a business trip. I was, I was, I was killing this guy from Xenoblade Chronicles in order to build an oil horse. And uh, now I have to see my girlfriend because of her parents around or something. <laughs> you can't stop me. She actually kind of likes me. I haven't even done anything. Yes, that mystic bond between us. It's not a mystic bond. It's a crazy siren hag who flies after me, dropping your weird messages on me. She interrupted me. I was making. I was talking to bloody Samwise Gamgee. I need to learn some poetry so I can recite it. You have to go to the taverns and find bards. <laughs> Maybe we'll do that. Uh, by the way, can you tell me where Gutlands is? I've got a date with him. He's a diplomatist. Ah, that's that's bad news. He's stuck in the void. I see. The campaign was cancelled because of a feast. We're all going to the feast instead. Is it going to be just me? It's going to be just me again, isn't it? Yeah, but it's just me. Just me and the girls. Oh, it's my girlfriend here. What was her name? <laughs> there you are, alien lady. Hello, pro hunter. It's so delightful to have the chance to spend time with you. I know. I'll be going. Farewell. <laughs> well, that was another good date. Another good date. Now, we're, oh yes, now I need to go talk to bloody Samwise again. This is this double life is very difficult to lead. And the prowl hunter came riding into town. He came up on the square <laughs> and took a look around. Oh shit! Don't up do Locals didn't seem to take too kindly to his face. Dum -dum 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 -dum. So he <laughs> reached into his coat and pulled out some grenades. Dum -dum -dum. They shot the man to pieces, left him dying in the street. He hoped the rest of his posse <laughs> would help avoid defeat. It seems they weren't advancing though. <laughs> oh, I think we broke the game. Uh, everyone judge. Nope, we gon' have to cheat again. <laughs> there we go. I have liberated your village from the banditos, etc. Ah, uh, yes, they all they all died of shame. I thought we could get through this playthrough without too much cheating, but alas, the glitch gods are not on our side. Uh, anyway, I'm trying to find bloody Samwise Gamgee so I can get him to like me so I can turn his whole goddamn house into an oil rig. The young man they called Pro Hunter, he had a special girl. The problem was she kept asking him to visit her on the other side of the world. I said, sure, my love, I will be there in just several years gotta go to Harper City looking for Gamgee Samways Samways it rhymes as good as it gets it's the best rhyme in the south in the south nothing rhymes that's just how it is in the desert God damn it, I can't find Samwise Gamgee, and gosh darn it if I ain't become a southern bale. Well, gosh darn it if I ain't a southern bale. That's not too bad, is it? That's not too bad.
I would. What? Who said that? Oh, hey, little miss it, lady Elena. You see, I'm just an old Texas Ranger. <laughs> Coming back from the, uh, the range <laughs> to, uh, to fulfill your request. Anything for a lady. They call it Southern Charm. <laughs> Here, look inside my jacket. I got all the Southern Charms you need. You just swallow them whole and oh my god, it goes down south like a charm. You know what I'm saying? I'm a laxative salesman. <laughs> All right, I'm not employed anymore, baby. <laughs> I changed. You gotta take me back. Uh, anyway, I still don't know any goddamn poetry. All right, I'm leaving. I <laughs> checked in with the old goif. Guess I'll just be going on my way. Yes, I need to visit all the taverns to try and find a goddamn bard to teach me poetry. Any bard? Wandering troubadour. Greetings to you, my noble sir. What is it you do? <laughs> Oh wait, I I am back on the continent. <laughs> when in Rome and all that. Tell me, wandering troubadour, do you think there's a place for me in the game of love? Oh, the game of love! Uh, be quiet, <laughs> be quiet over there, my Texan ranger schizophrenic alter ego. I'll be quiet for now. You can take the man out of Texas, you can't take the Texas out of a man. I see. <laughs> Well, I'll, I'll talk to the Surgeon General about it, shall I? Anyway, even though I'm a foreigner, what? <laughs> How dare you call me a foreigner? Uh, I think I, I don't know what country I'm from, to be honest. I'm from Capitalisma, the most wonderful place in the world. You wouldn't know about it, of course. I'm going to have to compete with the other lords. I know, I know. I wanted to be taught a song. I deflected her skeptical, skeptical, questioning darts. <laughs> it's so easy to read. Oh, with armor made of the purest devotion. <laughs> what? Push in the forge of my heart, oh baby. From the slag of any base of emotion. Um, yes, yes, yes. Very good. <laughs> but there are many stanzas to go. Oh, lordy lord. So here's the deal, boys. I'm just a southern bale. Southern bale, yeah. Why just a southern bell? Anyway, what I was saying is that General Sam Wise Gamgee, the one and only, has given us six balonic recruits. <laughs> Positively balonic, I tells you. And we have to train them up to be elite cavalry. What the hell? Oh no! <laughs> it's happening again! <laughs> The doctor said I would relapse. <laughs> I suppose I better up my dose. Uh, yes, so we just have to kill a few folk, and uh, then Samwise Gamgee will like me, then I can turn his house into a goddamn horse shitting oil bonanza. <laughs> or something to that effect. Whatever the Texas equivalent of that is. Somewhere. Beyond the sea, so, oops, somewhere waiting for me. My lover stands on golden sands and watches those pros go sailing by. Oh, darling, you. You sing divinely. Oh, don't I just, darling? <laughs> darling, you gonna go out there and be the best damn pro hunter you can, all right? <laughs> Anything for you, darling. <laughs> Anything I say. I'll go to the ends of the earth for you, darling. I'll, I'll even go to Fort Knox. <laughs> Steal everything they bloody have. Have we got them yet? Have we got the? Have we got the? No, we're not even bloody close. Oh no, oh, no, we are pretty bloody close actually. My lady, my lady, I come to you again in the dead of night, day, <laughs> dead, dead of something. You lied to me, nurse. You said it was night time. <laughs> bloody nurse. <laughs> One of these days, I'll buy a pocket watch. Now, <laughs> as I believe it's pronounced. I will now recite to you a famous poem. What was it called? 
storming the ramparts of randiness or something to that effect. I deflected her skeptical questioning darts <laughs> with armor made of the purest devotion. It's a song about a woman who suspected that her man was secretly courting some sort of, I don't know, southern belle, perhaps. And she threw questions at him like darts. <laughs> Little pieces of paper written on darts thrown across the room. <laughs> Luckily, his armor was made of the purest devotion. Devotion being a technical term for steel. <laughs> and he survived the ordeal. But although it is a fine tale of virtues, it speaks nothing of passion. Oh, 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 Lady Linda, would you like me to speak of passion? Would you like me to speak of passion? Oh, you're here, you're here, hello, stranger. Back to the boat, quickly. We'll speak of passion later, darling. I've got a very important business meeting. Very, very important business meeting. Oh, the business. Oh, my lordy lord. Don't take the Lord's name in vain, darling. <laughs> oh, God. It's the least of my crimes, I assure you. <laughs> well, I'm just a lonely Texas rancher. <laughs> trying to make my way in the world. No, no, it just doesn't sound right. Now, what's this bullshit? <laughs> Do I have to read all this text? I don't like it. I don't like the way it's justified. Let's let's have a look. I receive an offer of vassalage. What the bloody bullshit? <laughs> Mr. Prowl Hunter, sir. Mr. Prowl Hunter. I got a very special offer from you, from a man, a man named President John Carver. He wants you to swear an oath of homage to him and fight in his military campaigns. Ooh la la. What? What action are you trying to do, woman? <laughs> Anyway, he'll give me Prosser, so he just wants me to join the bloody confederacy, just straight up, like that. <laughs> you just seem so at home here, that's all, Mr. Prowl Hunter. There's barely any proles here at all. <laughs> Where are the Nazis to shoot? <laughs> this is the worst confederacy of all time. Uh, you, you wouldn't want to let me down now, would you, Prowl Hunter? <laughs> oh, now, now, don't cry, don't cry, my southern belle. <laughs> Make sure you don't tell my future wife about all of this. You see, I've, I've got a girl back home. Is she pretty, mister? I don't really know. I haven't, I haven't really glanced at her. It's, it's not really the point of marriage, is it? Oh, I don't know about that, sir. Anyway, I was just here to buy oil rigs. But suddenly... It feels like home, doesn't it, Mr. Pro Hunter? Yes. Oh, yes, it does. I'm a Texas boy at heart, don't you know? Uh, I feel like I used to be something else, don't you know? But I don't remember what it is. Ah, oh, the land of the free. It really, really makes you rethink everything, doesn't it? Ah, oh, what was that about the Nazis? <laughs> Who cares? Who cares anymore? You see, here in Texas, they don't judge you for investing in Nazi businesses. <laughs> and that's really the best I can hope for in the land that I will call home. All right, I will join the Confederation. <laughs> Let's do this shit. Thank you. Oh, I have to go swear an oath to President John Carver at New Yellen. Yes, I know where that is. <laughs> New Yellen. Wait, oh, New Yallon? Oh, Yallon's the place I own all that land. And now I'm going to New Yallon. How appropriate. I can easily sail back over to Yallon from there to check on my horrible estates. But where was the place they said they'd give me? It was called Prosser. Is it out in the fucking desert or something? Pros there. That's, that's a reasonable location. <laughs> in between Harper Street in London and New Yallon. <laughs> the perfect location for someone planning to rob the gold from Fort Knox. Just saying. Who is it who was just saying that? <laughs> well, I'll be going now, mister. Just a lonely prospector. <laughs> Thought I'd invade your mind for a moment before I fade back into the spirit realm. <laughs> There's so much gold in the spirit realm. Anyway, uh, some, some bastards fighting the Nazis. Good, good. Uh, you could hardly hear it from here in Texas. Anyway, <laughs> have I actually completed my mission yet? No, okay. Let's go swear loyalty to the Confederates. <laughs> As you do. 
And then we'll be right back into the oil industry. Amazing. So guys, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs>